Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today's YouTube's review will be on the albino YouTube's. Now, a few things before we get into this. You read the title correctly. I have yet another broken YouTube's. This one, it'll probably be a lot more obvious with what is broken. Because it may even pop off while I'm unboxing it. And just like Mimulus, I will not make a figure review of it until I get the new version. So it's just going to be gonna be a box version. And also with my Mimulus one, I sent you to the video for proof that it happened. And I guess I'm going to make this one for proof that it happened. So I will... This one, I will be getting out early tomorrow, so I can get it to them as soon as possible. And, yeah, that will be, that will be it for the introduction, and also another thing, you know what, I'll save that for the other video. So, opening him up, you have the sleeve, it has stars in the background and little buildings. There's a spotlight, and more buildings, and stars, and buildings, more stars, and another spotlight. Oh, and by the way, I did get this U2's before, like, the day it came out. This was the U2's that got me back into collecting it. Like, te technically Pyro, I haven't gotten any Pyro, any U2's since Pyrocynical, August 23rd. And I've looked at Quackity, but I still didn't get them. So, yeah, this is technically the YouTube's that got me excited back into collecting YouTube. So, if this figure didn't exist, you probably wouldn't have all these wonderful videos. And I wouldn't have to spend so much money. But, yeah. Also, another thing I wanted to say. I see his mouth, and he looks like uh, Ryan. R-I-A-N, I don't know if any of you guys have heard of him, but he's like, he does a lot of work with YouTubes, I think. I don't know if he's a YouTuber or not, but I just see him a lot on the YouTube subreddit. I check there often. Uh, if you want to know, like, any questions about further videos, maybe, like, DM me or something on Reddit. So, yeah. Maybe I'll respond, maybe I won't. I don't respond to DMs. I don't really respond to DMs that are NSFW. Uh, so, yeah. Also, I got noticed. Oh, wait, we're not even opening it. Also, I got noticed on Reddit, which the fact that my fans are reaching out to me on different platforms. Thank you, guys. It really means a lot to me. Wait, I may have spoiled a future video on one of my posts on Reddit. Anyway, on the side it says Idiot Box, and there are buildings uh, with light on it. Again, just pause the video and read it. I've also heard from people, uh, some of my friends that watch it, that they can't see the text. So, there you go. And all the spotlights... More spotlights and more buildings, and you have Albino. Also, this u is number 24, and unlike Elvis, there was no misprint. I thought this... I don't know if Elvis was... Elvis the Alien? I'm not sh That u I'm not sure if it was delayed. <clears throat> but I think it was, and that's why it had 21 instead of 14. By the way, U2's uh, shipped people their uh, boxes for with the 14. On Elvis and props to the people who put back together that box and also put the sleeve back together so they have two Elvis boxes one's a misprint all right so opening him up also sorry if this video feels rushed I'm trying to get it out as soon as possible it's still gonna be a premiere though but a bit earlier in the day even when I have like stuff to attend to the top says, you are about to unbox a professional YouTube idiot. Alright. Getting him out of the sleeve. On the 
inside it says, Albino, you beautiful person, and like the 20th Century Fox kind of logo. And there are spotlights, more buildings on the inside. So yeah, here's the figure. And it has a sleeve. And I will be showing you what happens. Ready, guys? The magic trick. Three, two, one. Amazing. So, yeah. <clears throat> I got this in the mail today. As of recording this, you'll see it the day after. And <clears throat> when I opened the box, I set it down on the table. <clears throat> and I, uh, I set it down on the table. And then the hand falls off. And then he falls over onto the floor. Luckily, no damage. But... His hand just randomly fell off. I don't know what it could have been from. I'm gonna check the inside. I think it may have been... Um... The, the hand part? Okay, with uh, further inspection, I think the hand part is uh, too small. So that's why it fell out easily. And... Yeah, I think that's why. So this may fall off more. So now you have photographic evidence, you choose. <laughs> and so, yeah, hopefully I get a response. And I don't think it'll probably take them too long uh, to get the figure replaced because Albino is still in stock. It's not like they have to make new ones. And I am still happy I... I have gotten an albino figure so yeah also stay tuned uh for more videos another guy came in the mail earlier this week so i don't think it was last week but, so, yeah look out for him and i believe more people will be coming in the mail this week that i will have to show you guys and make videos on so yeah that will be it so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye bye